Assalamu alaikum. Hi everyone. Hi dear students. I hope that you are good. Our module is business. The objectives, the outcomes and the prerequisites. The main objectives of the course Business English are to master various language and business skills. To know advanced business vocabulary, essential economic and business information, to know how to use language skills to get the necessary information from various sources, to know basic research skills, and to be able to communicate efficiently with other people, to use business vocabulary appropriately, to discuss and respond to the issues in the articles, to use business skills, to read and understand messages, letters, etc., and to respond appropriately, to make a summary in English, to use lexical and grammatical resources, to develop skills and different language skills useful in business communication, listening, speaking, reading, and writing. The content of the module studying the course of business English is based on the following two units, the unit one competitive strategy and the unit two quality. In the first unit competitive strategy, we are going to study six lectures the first lecture is strategic thinking, the second lecture is compet competition, the third lecture is companies and their industries, the fourth lecture is key strategic issues, the fifth lecture is innovation, and the last one preparing for the, for the future. The lesson one, strategic thinking. This lesson will focus on strategy. Students will have the opportunity to talk about the companies and their industries. The lecture to competition, focusing on the competitive nature of business. This lesson highlights the term competition. Students will be able to differentiate between the adjectives competing and competitive. The third lecture companies and their industries. Through this lesson, the students will be provided with the competitive forces theory of Michael Porter. Students will be dealing with the SWOT analysis and the competitive strategies. The fourth lecture, key strategic issues. In this lesson, students will look at the industries and their players. They will be analyzing why companies may may merge as an equal with another company of similar size or by competitors in the industry. Lecture 5, Innovation. In this lesson, students will be able to develop useful phrases for, inv for innovation and the development process. They will also be able to define the terms pioneers, followers, shakeout, and consolidation. The last lecture of the first unit is preparing for the future. With a focus on preparing for the future efficiently, students will have the opportunity to talk about scenario planning, futurology, and risk management. The second unit is about quality. In the first lecture, we study what is quality, what do we mean by quality, Lecture 2, Quality Standards. Lecture 3, TQM and GIT. Lecture 4, Quality and People. Lecture 5, The Management of Change. Lecture 6, Striving for Perfection. The Lecture 1, What is Quality? Through this lesson, students will be able to define quality and talk about quality in manufacturing and quality in services. Lecture 2, Quality Standards. This lesson focuses on quality standards and certifications. Students will be able to study the ISO 9000 as an example. 
the lecture three, TQM and GIT, students will focus on further quality vocabulary. They will be focusing on total quality management, Kaizen and just-in-time production. The lecture for quality and people, students will study models that emphasize the human dimension in improving quality. They will be focusing on vocabulary for describing two different models, investors in people and the European Foundation for Quality Management Excellence Model. The lecture five, the management of change. The students will be taught about change management and business process re-engineering. There will be also there will also be a discussion on the benefits of business process re-engineering. And the last lecture of the of the second unit, striving for perfection. In this lesson, students will have a chance to discuss topics related to quality, such as benchmarking and Six Sigma quality. That's all. Hope to see you soon. Thank you. Assalamu alaikum.